I can't. I have no idea. It looks like a like a street sign, but then it has like scooter handlebars or something. <laughs> Dude, that is amazing. What's up guys, it's Brandon Jay. Today we're gonna be sending this underwater drone over 130 feet down in an underwater cave called Hospital Hole. Tens of thousands of people come to this spring every single weekend, and if you drop something in Hospital Hole, it's 130 feet deep, there's no way you're ever gonna be getting it back. It's called Hospital Hole because a bunch of scuba divers actually don't make it out. So it's a pretty dangerous spot, which is why we're gonna be sending this underwater drone down there. I mean, this place could be littered with iPhones. I have no idea, maybe old fishing hooks, maybe scuba tanks, who knows what we're gonna find down there but since it's too dangerous for myself to drop all the way to the bottom we're gonna be sending this guy down and uh, hopefully he gets the job done I do want to take a quick second to say thank you guys so much really quick um, we've come out here quite a bit to Wiki Wachi. We ended up being out here on paddle boards, then we bought wave runners. We were able to, you know, explore this place on the wave runners. And now for the very first time, I actually have my big boat out here. I would never be able to do any of this stuff without you guys' help, let alone be able to like gather all of these like crazy wild tools that we have to make our videos like bigger and better. So when I come to a spot that I've filmed before at, um, but I'm bringing like a tool that's gonna help me access it better it's all because of you guys so i just want to say thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart for all the support on the past videos and the future videos and uh you guys supporting the channel has just led us to where we are figuratively and literally we wouldn't be here without you guys oh! <laughs> all right all right all right all right hey, can you really help me? oh man this kid's having a blast man so we're making our way and uh it's crazy because there's some like on our left side of the boat it's like six foot and on the right side of the boat it's like six inches so it's uh, hard to navigate but I think it's gonna be very much worth it to have the boat by hospital hole all the friends have the drone it's gonna be cool and we got the dog so life's good as long as we don't beach this thing it's freaking huge you got a big rock coming up on the right so stay your course brother stay your course we got a huge log directly underneath us coming up so uh, you might I think we're deep enough not to hit it. If you guys could see it right there, big old, big old log. This is gonna be an absolute mess. We're coming up on hospital hole and uh, we've got dogs and we've got boats. So two things that I didn't want to run into. We've got both of those, sick. All right, so we made it to hospital hole. On the left, you can see it's super shallow. And then on, on the right, it gets super, super deep. But what's really cool is all those little dots down there by the power poles, those are tons of mangrove snapper. It's pretty cool, man. Those things are everywhere. It's literally hundreds right there. So we're getting ready. We've got freaking wires everywhere down here. It's an absolute mess. Uh, but we have some kayakers who came out. It's their first time checking this place out too. Um, but they had a bunch of questions about this place. So I don't really know the answer to these questions, but I'm gonna ask them what they think's at the bottom. If you had to guess what's at the bottom, what do you think it would be? The bottom of this? Yeah. Doesn't sound exciting, but rock. Just rocks? You think like phones or anything like that? Oh. Like sunglasses. Sunglasses? Alright, so. You lost your sunglasses here. Oh, you lost your sunglasses? Yeah. Four? Five, four? Five. No way! Okay, so we guaranteed have four pairs of sunglasses with just one guy. So imagine how many people have lost stuff here. I'm thinking that there's literally tons of phones just riddled down there. So we'll see. They could get covered up by sand and stuff like that. So, you know, it's possible that we'll never actually know. Maybe we'll send like a magnet down there or something. But yeah, so we've got the drone and we've got some sunglasses and a bunch of boats for phones. So we'll see. Get underwater drone, become a scuba diver. It'll be fun. <laughs> no, honestly, this thing compared to the last drone. I oh, know, sorry, sorry. All right, black cord's mine, yellow cord's yours. We'll try not to twist them. All right, all right, we got this. <laughs> this is probably the most electronics we've ever used combined in, into one video. Uh, so this is the full comm unit. So I have a couple of these. The underwater divers could actually talk to each other other if they wanted to it's just gonna be me so I'll be only talking to you guys this is gonna be dropped down in the water this is the transducer that these two talk to this transducer runs all the way to this box so whatever I'm saying underwater the guys on the boat above water will be able to hear and they'll be able to grab this microphone and be able to talk to me as well so it's really cool it's a two-way comms from surface to below and uh, if I see anything really cool or I want Hudson to send a drone in a certain tunnel, I can tell him to do that. So this is where teamwork makes the dream work. First things first, we're gonna run a basic comms test. Uh, so we don't have the drone in the water yet, but I'm gonna do a big lap around the cave. I'll be able to talk to you guys, show you a little bit of what it's gonna look like from like, I don't know, maybe 10 to 20 foot. And uh, once we get the comms figured out and worked in, uh, we'll throw the drone down there. We're gonna drop it all the way down to the bottom. Audio test, one, two. 
Audio check, one, two. I hear you loud and clear. I'm really glad we have the drone. It's super murky. You're underneath the front of the boat. Hudson, I wish you could see what I'm seeing right now. I'll be able to see in just a few when we get that drone down there. Wow, what a freaking incredible experience. Hey buddy, that was cool, right? Dude, I could see everything, it was so beautiful. The uh, water was a bit murky, so I'm glad we have the drone because if I was going down, that'd be super creepy. Phase one testing is complete. We've got the audio from bottom to surface like dial then yeah, it was it's crispy dude perfect i got no worries it's now. so cool so um basically what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get that same thing i'm gonna be underwater however hudson he's gonna be manning the drone now what you guys don't know is hudson for like the past week has been using this drone he's pretty much my official underwater drone pilot at this point <laughs> uh so he actually has videos on his channel as well using this thing so if you guys want to go over there and see that it's gonna be linked in the description below also drop him a sub he's one of my best friends he's been doing youtube for a while and he's finally monetized so show him some love uh but Right now, this is going to be phase two out of phase three. Phase two is we're going to see what all this drone can do. I'm going to be looking at the drone. The drone's going to be looking at me. We're going to follow each other. It's going to be a really cool experience. Um, and uh, we'll turn on the lights. I'll be telling Hudson like different maneuvers I want him to make and things to check out. And then after that, I'm going to come up on board. And then together, we're going to watch the screen of this thing diving all the way down to the bottom. Like yeah, th that's insane. the we're moment. We're just going to send it. That's the moment we've been waiting for. So this is going to be phase two. I think this is going to be one of my favorite things is watching how this drone moves in the water while I'm in the water too. So it's like I have my own little personal cameraman, but like you're up you know yeah i'm just up, up top up on the surface so super cool travis you might uh, get replaced by this drone man. no <laughs> no this drone right. can't take those thumbnails dog <laughs> with that being said we're gonna drop this thing in the water and uh we're gonna go to phase two let's do it this is so crazy dude it is super clear i'm watching you right now in 1080p baby Alright, go ahead and follow me. I'm gonna take you on a walk around the cave. Dude, this is insane. This is insane. Oh my god, this is crazy. Bro, this is absolutely insane. I'm literally following you. I'm right with you, dude. Turn around and look at the fish. Look up, look up some. Go that way. There you go! Oh my god, that's so cool! Come back to daddy. Bro, this is so incredible. Dude, with how crystal clear this is right now, I cannot wait to send this to the bottom. Oh my god. <laughs> dude, it's like I had a drone as a best friend. This is so sick, dude. <laughs> Bro, this is our best. This is our best idea we've ever freaking had. Dude, but you're gonna lose your mind. <laughs> I gotta see some of this footage, man. Go ahead and shut that baby down. And uh, we're gonna save all the battery.
<laughs> that was the coolest freaking thing. I was like, what's up drone? Come on with me. This is sparking so many new ideas for me and I wanna make a deal with you guys. If we can get 10,000 likes on this video, I'll take the drone, I'll have Hudson pilot it and I'll go on like a, a big drop off, spear fishing. I'll have Hudson scope out the fish, come back to me, tell me where they are and I'll go spear them. I think that that could be a really cool video with the drone and the comms. It's like next level, man. It's like literally having my best friend down there uh, even though he's not scuba diving with me. So it's super cool. If you guys wanna see that, let's get 10,000 likes on this video. Now it is finally time to explore the bottom of hospital Dude, hole. We're sending Wally to the bottom. We're to, <laughs> we are really sending her down to the bottom, man. It was so freaking cool looking at the lights. Oh my gosh. All right, I hope you guys are enjoying. This is probably one of my favorite videos I've ever filmed. And surprisingly, it's actually working out the exact way we want it to. Let's find 10,000 iPhones this. on the bottom of hospital hole. One small step for man, one question finally answered for Brandon J. What is at the bottom of Hospital Hole? Here we go. I feel like that was rather yeah. aggressive. Maybe I should have... Well, yeah, Reef just came out from <laughs> his slumber. <laughs> Maybe I should have just done a, a, a nice easy talk. All right. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Watch out, buddy. Okay. All right, we're down. So what are we doing right now? Huh? Going down. Oh, we're, are we going down like this? What is that? Oh, we're going like nose down. So we much sediment. To back off 85 percent battery <laughs> get to the bottom right Hudson. down all right well i'm gonna level her out she's going down all right so right now we're dropping the drone horizontally and pa flying past sediment i'm gonna look up see if i can see the surface anymore oh, oh my wow, god wow there's the boat oh my that's god. cool man this is so sick wow level her out <laughs> keep going yeah just keep dropping her down then yeah i gotta 20 meters hold on hold on hold on, hold on. you're you're freaking flying right now kid <laughs> i think if i hold it like this but Dude, actually just take it i can't what? see anything wait what all the way around me all right I'm I'm feeding some line. Oh, dude, what are we looking at here? Hold on, hold on, wait, pause. I don't see anything, just sediment. Hold on, I I'm can't. gonna look straight up. Here, tilt nothing. my way. I can't see. I, if I look straight up, nothing. If I look straight down, nothing. Wait, are we in? Oh, oh, okay, okay. So one thing I know about Hospital Hole, it has a layer of this. Uh, gosh, I cannot remember the name, but it smells like rotten eggs. Like uh, sulfur or something? Yes, a layer of like sulfuric acid. Does that sound wrong or is that possible? Oh, whoa, hold on. Did, hold did on. you crash through it? It's right there. Yeah. We are level with it. Yes. So if we come so, up. So, okay, as a scuba diver, if you get stuck in a hospital hole and you can get lost in that layer and get completely disoriented, just like Hudson is on the drone right now, like not really sure where he is. What depth are we rocking right there? 27 and a half meters. All right, so that's 20, 30, uh, so... So it's 30, so 30, so probably somewhere around 90 feet right there. Somewhere around 90 feet the drone is at right now. What? All right, what's going on? Okay, Hold okay, on. so Hold we're at 29 meters. Okay. If I look down, leave. Oh, we reached the bottom of the hospital hole. Is that Dude, it? Give me is some, that it? We freaking hit the bottom. Oh my God, I that's, just see That's got to be it. Okay, now this could be a shelf though. So if you can, without, do not stir up the bottom. Like try your absolute best. Try to go side to side or whatever you can. Look at nothing is moving down there. There's no current. So if you blow that out, it's just gonna sit, sit. there. Oh, what is that? Brandon, you need to stop walking away. Oh, oh get out of there. <laughs> That's a freaking whole tree. Yeah, don't get wrapped up in that. Oh no. That's crazy. <laughs> Dude, how absurd is this? You said, what is that? <laughs> So There's still the bottom. Leave. That's kind of how I want to. How I can't cruise it like that though. Okay. Yeah. We'll just have to like continue and gander down. Get a level out. <laughs> Dude, the fact that we're like, all right, we are now at seventy-seven percent because we got to bring it back home, about dude. This. We got to bring it. hundred percent lighting. Twenty-nine meters, dead. And I, I wonder if you went lights out, if you'd even be able to see. It's probably. Like, nope. Nope, zero light. Just be careful. It's, if you, what was that? What is that? It, wait, that's something metal. Whoa. I'm still diving, bro. Yeah, but what is that? That's something metal. That's no like a idea. sign. No idea what that is. Well, we gotta investigate that. Don't don't go anywhere. 
Did we just lose transmission? Bro, what is happening? <gasps> oh, oh my God, we lost connection and it came back. That like, was so like scary. Very briefly, very Ooh. briefly. <laughs> all right, all right, so we're still looking at... All right, I'm just going to go level. Oh, oh, okay, that's okay, the bottom. Okay, all right, that okay. is definitely... Look at how much silt that is. All right, we're going to go get up and, out of yeah. this. Oh, we need no. to get level here. Right, okay, right, we're just yeah. going to get up out of that. Okay, so that is literally... See if I can just look down at it a little bit. Oh, Got blown no, out. Go no, up no. again. Need to come up. I can I have no idea. It looks like a like a street sign, but then it has like scooter handlebars or something. All right, we're gonna go level. You want to bring her back up? I think so, man. I don't want to lose the drone. I'm a little nervous, but I mean, we've answered a lot of questions. This just freaks me out coming straight up because I don't know if I'm under a shelf. Yeah. And then just sediment, sediment, Boom. sediment, sediment. It goes it's complete clouds, dude. Slow down. Slow now down we got color. Slow. If I look up, nothing though. See that? Literally just a layer. It's like milk, dude. It's like. So we can get up out of it. It literally looks like a vape cloud. Honestly, that's dude, what it looks like down this there. This thing gains so much ground underwater; it is insane. All right, we're gonna look up. There's light again. Boom. All right, so check this out. I want to see this thing come back to the surface. All right, hold on, hut. Hold on. Oh, I see lights, dude! I see lights! No, look back up. That is the freaking craziest thing. Look at it. Bro, that is so trippy, bro. Look back up at me. Look back up. <laughs> you gotta look back up, Hudson. Where are you? Look up. Oh, dude, that is... Bro, that is the most absurd thing I've ever seen. Just keep her going, dude. Just go straight to the top. Go, go, go. Dude, that is amazing. That looks like a UFO. <laughs> Wow, our little drone baby, our little drone baby did it. All right, mission complete, brother. Wow, hut, we did it, bro. <laughs> that was amazing. <sighs> wow, and she is bro. back from the depths, bro. <laughs> Dude, I cannot freaking express to you how insane that is, bro. I have dove here so many times. I've explored around this thing, and I've never made it to the bottom of hospital hole. And now I know that I never want to visit the bottom of hospital hole. That was incredible, man. All right, guys. Well, mission finally accomplished. I am not just saying this because this drone was sent to me. I promise to you, this is one of the funnest experiences I've personally had in the water. It was so cool like that. I'm okay, son. I'm literally right here. We're, we're good. I can see you. You can see me. We're good. <laughs> in all seriousness though, I think my favorite part was being able to dive down talk to Hudson while he was manning the drone. It was literally like having one of my best friends experiencing the same things underwater that I was. <laughs> you good, buddy? You making it? <laughs> Alright, guys. Oh, God. You good? Alright. <laughs> As long as he has his paw. <laughs> I know, man. He's, he feels better now. <laughs> Somebody to lean on. <laughs> All right, kid. Really, get off my shoulders. Please, man. Come on. Just let daddy film. Let daddy film for two seconds. Please. Please. Put your feet <laughs> on the boat. If you guys have watched the channel before, you know that I've used underwater drones in the past. However, it seemed like at the time, technology wasn't really where I wanted it to be to be able to like do the type of videos that I wanted with it. I really wanted to use the drone as a tool instead of a toy. And when I was using this thing today, it really felt like a tool and it acted like one, like rightfully so. We dropped it all the way down to hospital hole. We dropped it, I don't even know. I think it was like well past a hundred feet. We explored the bottom. We found some really cool stuff that we'd never be able to experience with our own eyes if it weren't for this drone today. So, so big thing Thank you to chasing i'm gonna leave a link in the description below if you guys want a drone like this you'll be able to find it there and most importantly this video could not be done without my best friend hudson he was manning the pilot while i was in the water this literally would not i would not be able to do this without him so if you want to see more videos of hudson they're going to be linked in the description below as well and hudson if we get 10,000 likes on this video you're going to be finding all those fish while we're spear fishing yeah well, absolutely while i'm spear fishing you're pointing them out yep neil just tell me where to go that means i'm like inadvertently spear fishing right kind of i think you will still need a fishing license <laughs> all right guys so that's gonna wrap it up hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm so glad we finally solved the mystery of what is at the bottom of hospital hole and it didn't disappoint super creepy super spooky just like i expected and i uh, hope you guys enjoyed as always we'll catch you guys on the next adventure peace out we survived kid we freaking survived man we survived buddy yeah you have fun
<laughs> Reef fell asleep half the time, man. Test me yet, I'm outnumbered, but I won't lose no 